Hello everyone! Our previous tutorial delved into personal views, their creation and advantages. Over time, an accumulation of this use might make navigation a bit challenging. Today, I will show you how to declutter by removing a personal view in Microsoft Dynamics 365. As a bonus, we will discuss how to delete system views which can be managed only by system administrators or system customizers. You should also have the proper security role for that. We also have the public view type, but we won't delve into it as a system-defined public use cannot be deleted. Also, public use can be managed in the same way as system use. Let's see how to differentiate between system and personal use. Access the drop-down menu to explore all views. The personal views are indicated by a special icon next to them. The system use lacks this icon. For additional details, move the cursor to the information button, located on the right. Alright, let's jump into removing a personal view. Step 1. Navigate to the entity. On the top right corner of the app or at makepowerapps.com, select Settings button. Click on Advanced Settings. Look for and select the Advanced Find button, which usually looks like a few no icon. Step 2. Define your query. With an Advanced Find interface, select the table where you want to delete views. Then tap on the Saved Use option. A list of views will emerge. Locate the desired view, mark it checkbox, and then hit Delete Saved View. Note, you might encounter access issues if you don't have the required permissions. In such a scenario, you need to seek permission from the view's owner. Now, for the system use, remember you should either have system administrator or system customizer security role to proceed. For advanced users, these steps are ideal for those who are involved in migrating changes between different environments. Head to makepowerapps.com. Make sure the right environment is selected. Tap on Solutions and find the solution in question. Identify and open tables views you intend to modify. Mark the views you want to erase. Click Remove and then click Delete from this environment. Lastly, don't forget to publish your adjustments. For non-advanced users, if you are not involved in cross-environment migrations, you can opt for this simpler route. Direct yourself to makepowerapps.com. Select Tables. Follow the previously mentioned steps. Choose Table. Identify Views. Delete. And subsequently publish. That wraps up our session for today. You are now equipped to distinguish between personal and system views and know the procedures to delete them. This knowledge will surely enhance your user experience. Thank you for joining us and until next time, stay efficient! If you enjoyed the video, please give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe to stay tuned. We would love to hear your experience in the comments. Additionally, you can find a lot of exciting information on our blog. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our consultants. We are always here to help.